y'all, it's Tara. Welcome back to my channel. It's the video we've all been waiting for. It is the 3K giveaway video. Oh, I'm so excited. Uh, I do want to apologize because I did hit 3K and I stayed over 3K, I don't know, a couple months ago. But uh, it's just, it's taken me forever. I'm still kind of a little bit playing catch up after vacation, which was has been over a month now. <sighs> things have been crazy. Uh, life's been crazy, but I just want to thank you guys for getting me to 3,000. I have been on th this here app for, oh my god, since November of 2015, I think, uh, forever, and I just now hit 3,000 subscribers. <laughs> But granted, I did take quite a while off, uh, you know, to start my own business and to be a boss bitch. So um, I was not uploading um, content on the regular for several years. But, you know, y'all know I'm back. We back. We up in this mug, honey. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you so, so, so much for all of your support. I always enjoy chatting with you guys in the comments. Thank y'all so much for stopping by. Thanks for continuing to support my channel, to watch my videos, and to also take the time out of your busy lives to even, you know, leave me little comments and little chitty chats. I really, really, really appreciate you guys. I adore uh this platform so much i don't i don't know why but it's sort of become my home okay so let me just be quiet why are we here we are here because this is my 3k giveaway video i'm going to show you guys everything that i'm going to be giving away but let me first run through some of the rules so this is for us only guys i'm sorry sorry my international subbies but this giveaway does contain polish and i'm not gonna pay to ship polish uh overseas uh us only i apologize again you must be 18 years of age. You do have to be sub to me, obviously, duh, as well as Madam Glam, because Madam Glam is the co-sponsor of this here giveaway. They did send me some products to include in this giveaway, but the rest of it I either purchased or it's just stuff that I have that I'm just you know, decluttering, downsizing, uh, helpful little things for you guys. So again, you do have to be subbed to me as well as to Madam Glam. And I will be checking, and I will be checking, which means you do have to have your subs set to public. So you cannot have your subby set to private. And if you don't know how to do that, or if you don't know how to check your settings, I'll put a link up in the cards above to a G Money video and she walks you through the steps for how to check and make sure that your subscriptions are public because again I do need to be able to see that you have subbed to both me and also Madam Glam. So this giveaway will close on June the 30th and I will have G Money pick a winner while she's here and she's going to be here for a couple of weeks. I'm going to close the video, close the giveaway and turn off comments and that kind of thing um, on June the 30th like midnight going into the next day. The 30th is a Friday. So yeah, like 11.59 p.m. Eastern that Friday, June the 30th, I'll turn everything off. And then a couple days later, whenever we get around to it, uh, I will have her pick a winner and then I'll do a video. Don't think it's gonna happen like the next day. I mean, we're gonna be on vacation and having fun. So it'll probably be the first full week of July or something before I get that video up. But this video is also not sponsored by YouTube. It's really only sponsored by me and uh, Madam Glam, I guess. Okay, so how do you enter? How do you enter? How do you enter? There will be a secret word or a secret phrase that will pop up on your screen, somewhere on your screen, at some point during this video. So to enter, drop that keyword or that little key phrase down into the comments below. That's it, you have to watch the video, find the little keyword, key phrase, Easter egg, drop that in the comments below. And of course, you have to be a resident of the US, you have to be over the age of 18. And for the 50th time, you have to be subbed to both myself and Madam Glam. Okay, let me dive into this big old box of goodies, honey. This honkin' box is gonna contain gel products, stampin' products, non-gel products, you know, like regular indie polishes, nail accoutrement. 
I think there's some stickers in here. I'm also gonna toss in a couple of my bases loaded lacquer beer koozies because God knows I have 27,000 of these. Yeah, oh, and I'll, you'll probably get a magnet too. I thought I had a magnet in here, but I don't. So you're gonna get a couple of bases loaded lacquer beer koozies, Coca-Cola koozies. I'm gonna go ahead and toss in the little Model 1's Meow Lamp, which is the, mm -mm 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 -mm. shit, what was it? Oh, the little eight watt lamp. I unboxed this, I don't know, six weeks ago or so. It's just a little eight watt lamp to help you sort of flash cure your gel products. If you're doing gel extensions, whatevers, it does come with all the things. Got the little USB port. I do apologize because I did rip this open accidentally. When I was trying to pull that out and check it out, I'm gonna toss in some Madame Glam Gel Removal Nail Clips. There are 10 clips in here, and it does say that they are that they are touch screen friendly. So if you are one that likes to soak, or if you uh, have clients, you know, that prefer to soak off their gel polish, as opposed to you zapping it off with an e-file, boom, there you go. Never been used brand spanking new. I'm gonna toss in three silicone molds. Have little uh, three different sizes of bows. This is one of my faves. Y'all know me. Y'all know I love me some flowers and some leaves and some little teddy bears. These came from Betsy, I do believe. I had some or maybe I had purchased some or maybe G Money had given me some and then I wound up buying a mystery bag. Oh, silicone molds and these were dupes. So I pulled these out and tossed them into the giveaway and you know, I'm really digging into the box. This is brand new, unopened, and this is a nail polishing pen. This is basically like, kind of like a mini version of an e-file. However, the max speed is only 12,000 RPMs. Basically what you would use this for, and oh yeah, it is uh, USB powered. It's like rechargeable. What you would use this for would be to uh, to take the, um, or to, the, okay, Tara, good grief. What you would use this for would be to etch the inside of your nail tips. And I also believe that this actually comes with a set of bits as well. So you can do a little bit of like your nail prep, that kind of a thing. Um, it is, it is a skinny little guy. It's not like a big, you know, heavy e-file handpiece. Um, but it does have, I, again, uh, don't quote me, but I'm pretty sure it does come with, um, a set of, uh, drill bits and you just push the drill bit down into it. It doesn't lock and unlock, but this is something you're, you're not going to be using to like file off acrylic product, right? Um, because again, it does only go up to 12,000 RPM, but hey, it's a little mini nail polishing pin, Madam Glam calls it. So there you go. And you know, and this ain't cheap. I mean, this thing's probably 60 bucks right there. Uh, so don't think it's a little junky thing. And what else do we have? Oh boy. Okay. So I stuffed this. This is, let me see if I can zoom y'all out. This, this came in a Model 1 starter kit, collection kit thing that had lots of things in it. Uh, the little bag did, and I have just stuffed this bag full of stuff. So let's do an unzippy zip. When I filmed that video, when I did that unboxing and did that, you know, ran through that Model 1 starter kit, I really fell in love with this little bag. And I was, and I remember saying in my video, oh, I may take this with me on vacation. I never did. So this is brand new. Like I never traveled with this. I never put anything in here. So I don't think you're getting a used, a used little bag, but I'm going to toss in some little flame uh, stickers. And again, this bag is stuffed full and I'm just pulling stuff out. Uh, a little duster brush. I have one of these myself and I really enjoy it. So now I have, I had an extra, so boom, giving you one little crystals on it. A cuticle revitalizer oil. This is just a little click up cuticle oil pen. It is rose scented. I do not get jiggy with floral scents. So I said, oh, hell no. I do not want this. Let me give it to my amazing subscribers on the old tube of views. I'm going to toss in a couple of, what is this? Uh, 
Striping tape. Yeah, duh. There we go. Uh, a silver and a gold. Silver and gold. I will never not sing that song every time I say silver and gold. All right, I'm going to toss in a pack of nail forms. I have a humongous honker thing of these nail forms. They're okay for me. Like, they, they do the job. I don't use nail forms all the time, obviously. They work just fine for what I need them to do. If you're a beginner, I think this is a pretty standard beginner uh, nail form. So, there you go. Y'all already know I'm obsessed with Ribbit Stickets Hand and Cuticle Cream. They're uh, like little samples of Christie's Unforgettable Hand and Cuticle Cream. I'm gonna toss in three different scents. This one is Coffee Shop. This one is Rocky Mountain Memories. So this is gonna be like uh, your evergreen, you know, your outdoorsy, uh, woodsy type flavor. Uh, and what is this? Oh, Beechwood Vetiver. Oh, this is one of my favorites. One of my favorites. So you'll be able to try if you do not know and if you do not already love Christie's Unforgettable Hand and Cuticle Cream. You're going to be able to try it. And then I already know y'all are going to go stock up on the big honkers because I have many, many, many of her two ounce and her big old one ounce. Oh, see, this is a uh, beach sage and mint. I have a million. I have a million. And you know what? I decided I can go ahead and part. I can part with three of these. So there you go. These are parrot polish soaps. I have so, so, so many that David has sent me in PR packages. So these are what? There's five of these right here. These are really pretty. And is it this one? Yes, I think it's this one. And you probably can't see because my camera doesn't want to focus where I want it to focus. But this has a really beautiful uh, blue shimmer. So I think these are glycerin soaps and I do not believe they are scented. Otherwise, my entire uh, salon space would smell like these soaps because I have a trillion of them. And just a couple more little two hills that I have stuffed in the Model 1's bag. I'm just going to give you all um, a little pair of, I almost said bent, of uh, curved, curved tweezers. And well, this is my favorite. I know some people call this the tool of death. It's the double-ended, you know, cuticle scraper. I freaking love, love, love to get in here with this tool. Well, not this one, obviously. Um, I have my own. And this guy, I use this same tool. This is not mine. So I'm giving you this, this is brand new, uh, to push back Nana's cuticles when I do, when I do hers. So you're going to be getting those. I think we all have a million trillion quintillion of them little things. Okay, so now let's get into the stamping stuff. I am going to give you guys a crystal clear stamper and scraper set from Maniology. This is the Ice Cube stamper. I freaking love it. This one was a limited edition, actually, because this was a stamp for a cause. Uh, so that's why it's yellow. That's why it has the little thing on the top, as well as the scraper. Um, I can't remember. Oh, I bought like a, an empowerment uh, stamp for a cause bundle. I don't know. It was like women empowerment and mental health. I can't remember what like the name of the cause, but I have the clear one and I use my ice cube stamper all the freaking time. Uh, I absolutely adore it. And I thought, you know what? If no one has tried the ice cube stamper for maniology before, then I will part with my brand new one. Yeah. Stamp for a cause. Ice Cube Stamper, again, limited edition, a little yelly one, and then I've got some, I don't even know what all is in here. Okay, so uh, full disclosure, G Money gave these to me. I've never used them, so she, I think she just uh, swatched them, like, for one of her videos. This may have been like a Manny by Me box or something. I don't know. So you're going to get, they're gorgeous. I just, I haven't used them. And if I haven't used them in a year, then I probably won't. Uh, Mangrove and I don't know what my camera is focusing on. Almost, I thought that said Taco. Toco Toucan. I think it's Toco. And Mangrove. Beautiful, 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 beautiful colors. They both stamp. <laughs> lawlessly even over black so you're gonna get those two 
those would be those are great for this time of year too so boom there you go some maniology stamp and polishes and then i may wind up taking this out of the box because there's only one thing in here i'm going to part with uh my favorite smudge free top coat from maniology we all know we've all been there unless you're unless you're a beginner and you don't know sometimes um quick dry top coats can smudge your stamping maniology smudge free top coat man when they released this, it was a freaking game changer, honey. And these are some of my favorite scrapers. Born, this is a Born Pretty. This is a Born Pretty. This is an Edubus scraper. And this is a Bundle Monster, AKA Maniology now. But they're all four different because you need different scrapers for different needs. Uh, if you're doing more of like the um, negative space, there we go. Uh, and, and you do have a large area of negative space. Maybe you don't want a super soft, a flimsy scraper that you may accidentally, you know, pull your polish. Anyway, we're not getting into all that right now. If you are a stamper, or even if you're, you're not a stamper, but you want to try it, you want to get into it, you will need different scrapers for different things, right? For different images. So I've given you four very different, this one is a stiff hard plastic one it's not terrible i really don't enjoy the stiff hard plastic ones because most of them are shitty 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 quality but this one is smooth on all four sides because some of these just be jaggedy as hell and they're just trash and i immediately throw them in the garbage this one is whoops this one is more of a credit card style it is much thicker but it's not as stiff as this guy again this is going to come in handy for certain images as well. These two are thinner, but this is the most thin out of the four. Love, love, love. I have, I think, a 10-pack from Born Pretty of Christmas scrapers. And I was like, you know what? <laughs> I can go ahead and part with some of these as well. So these are all brands that I, I think all of them are. Hold on. I'm just double checking. Yes. All um, branded plates. I've used these brands for a long, long time. Let me go ahead and zoom y'all back in a little bit. Uh, so they're not junky. Don't think I just took out some old shitty plates and tossed them in here. This one is a Born Pretty plate. Lots of sort of um, mandala images. I hope y'all can't see me because I am a skank, honey. It's been a long day. Gorgeous, gorgeous. These are larger images as well. So if you have longer nails, these are larger images. That's very nice, and I don't want to blind y'all, so. Well, here, let me put it under the shade. There, okay. And another Bundle Monster, aka Maniology. This one is uh, Geo Trendy, and this is BM XL354. Has just some geometries on there. And this is another Geo Trendy BM XL353. So you got 353 and 354. As you can see, geometrics, geometrics. And some of these would be great for like reverse stamping too. So there you go. There you go. And then I've got four just small round plates. This one is a Nicole Diary. And it's kind of odd. Wasn't my style. And I thought. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of this. It's just taking up space. But it does have some Pegasus. Some Pegasuses on here. And what? A tiger and like some little masks. So that is Nicole Diary 004. This is a Nicole Diary 001. Sort of lacy. And they're kind of fat. They're not super skinny fine lines. And if you've been stamping for a while, you know, sometimes the really fine lines are hard to pick up. I own dozens, literally dozens of Nicole Diary plates. Never had a single issue with any of those. And then Winstonia, another brand. I own dozens of these plates. Amazing quality. More leaves. You know, I thought, Tara, do you really need another another freaking plate? Girl, go ahead and part with it. So, got a little ladybug here. Little iguana and some leavery. These remind me of footballs. I don't know why. So, there's that. And then this Winstonia plate. So, if you're into fairies and sort of ethereal, mystical type designs. Uh, we do have some stars, and this is Winstonian's 420. Mm, maybe you smoke weed, 420 is for you, and this one was 403. Okay, so that does it for all my stamping plates. 
Now, I'm pretty sure the only thing that's left to discuss are the polishes. Ooh. I think I'm gonna continue on, pardon me, y'all, this box is out of control. I'm gonna continue on, oh, time to zoom y'all out again a little bit. Continue on with the maniologies. Oh, and looky here, three more little parrot polish soaps. So I've got, this is another Maniology Stamping Polish. Oh, you know what? This also came in, or came with um, that stamp for a cause, you know, the, with the limited edition uh, Ice Cube Stamper. And I never use this. And it's called Serenity. And it's just a very, like, royal purple metallic. I think that's the best way to describe it. I may have taken the lid off of it, but I obviously never used it and I never swatched it on the top. So that is a full size Serenity stamping polish. This is So Metal. In case you don't know, Maniology used to be called Bundle Monster. So these are lots of Bundle Monster stamping polishes over here. But this is, again, another creative art polish. And I've never used this. This does say nail lacquer. I don't think I've used this. I don't know. This could be sort of like the two-in-one where you can use it as a regular polish, but then also stamp with it. This one I know for a fact that I have never used. Oh, I thought I had another. Oh yeah, this came in, in a two-pack, Soft Sage. So this is just a regular, like full size and their uh, regular stamping polishes are 13, 13 mils. But this was a mini, which is seven mil. So again, we got So Metal and Soft Sage. This one is also mine and I never use. It's called Fireside. So this is just a medium, just straight up red Fireside. That'd be great for Christmas manis too, Christmas stamping. And this one is a purple uh, Lunar Lines. These two are full size. These three are full size. That's the mini. Actually, these four are full size. Yeah, so this could be like the metallic version of this purple. And it looks like it's been used a lot. It has not. It has, I haven't used it. I think it's just settled. Anyway, there's a ton of polish in there that y'all can use. This one is not full. I think G Money may have given me this one. She may have brought it and just said, girl, keep it. Or maybe she had to. This is Heart of Gold. This is also a 13 mil. I never used this, but again, there's still a ton left in here. And this is Parrot Polish, and this is Blue Sinai. Is it a thermal or a solar? It's a thermal. So my very first Parrot Polish PR package, he sent this to me to swatch, and I put it in the video, and if you missed that, I will put the link up in the cards as well. And then in a very recent PR package, he sent me a duplicate, and I emailed him, and I'm like, yo, you already sent me this one. Uh, so I'm just going to toss this one into my uh, giveaway box. I'll go ahead and plop my um, my swatch photo up here of this so you can see. Uh, off the top of my head, I can't remember, but I think this may be a tri-thermal. It may transition three colors. I don't know. We'll judge by the photo up here. But it's a gorgeous blue, and it has some subtle shimmer in it, and it's just freaking stunning. So this is brand, brand new. So thank you, David from Parrot Polish for that little snafu because now someone else gets to enjoy one of your beautiful polishes. So I'm gonna put all these back in here. Uh, these are gonna ship like just like this because it's just convenient for me. Pink padded boxes. So then we'll uh, wrap up with the rest of the gels. Okay, so you guys know how my heart absolutely sings for Model Ones, whoop, Model Ones color cubes. They're solid cream gel polishes you already know. One of these I purchased and the other one came in that starter kit that came with the little orange bag that I already showed y'all. But I already owned this color cube. So the one that came in the kit, <clears throat> the starter kit, I was just like, you know what? I'm just gonna toss it into the giveaway. And I don't know which one this is. Yeah, okay, so this is the one. I did not purchase this one, this one came with the starter kit. So this is Crazy as Jelly Bean, and it also, of course, will come with the brush and instructions. And if you're wondering what Crazy as Jelly Bean looks like, you should already know, because I've done like 15 uh, nail art designs <laughs> and swatched it a million times. This is Crazy as Jelly Bean, tons of neons, like the quintessential summer color palette. 
So this is mine, of course. You'll be getting the brand, brand new one. That is craziest jelly bean. But this one, and I already know, I'm not gonna open it again, but I have one. And you're gonna get Sparkle Party, which is this stunning palette. So you're gonna have a white, and then you're gonna have like a, and these are like jellies. Um, this is probably clear, uh, like silver hollow. And then you got some gold hollow. Y'all, y'all know what colors look like. Okay, so this is Sparkle Party. This is mine. I've had this for months. Um, I bought one for the giveaway and one for myself. I've had this for months and I haven't even gotten around to swatching it. I haven't even used it yet. Craziest Jelly Bean and Sparkle Party. There's things going on in this house. It, today is, um, even though it's 12.50 a.m. on June the 6th, it is Spawn's birthday. So Mr. Brave's Diva uh, baking cupcakes. Happy birthday, Spawn. So yeah, you're gonna get two nine color color cubes. And then this is our final box of goodies. And I don't even remember what all the heck is in here. I know what some of it is. The teardrop, a little mini. I don't think that's showing color accurate on the screen, but uh, seven mil, another stamping polish from Bundle Monster. This one is Grey Joy. It's kind of a beige leaning gray. It's kind of grayish. Full size 13 mil stamping polish. I'm gonna give you two uh, bases loaded lacquers. We have Progress. This was a fundraiser polish to benefit in the backlog.org for rape kit testing. Uh, I think this was last year's polish. And then G Money made a custom, or I made a custom, I guess, for G Money's grandson. Lucasaurus. I had an extra bottle and uh, this is just a stunning, stunning goldy green just packed with linear hollow. It's absolutely stunning. And we have an Agatha Ruiz de la Prada gel polish and this is called Gel Aqua. Brand new. I've never used this. I think I did open it just to see if the color matched the little sticker on the outside. So this is a gel polish and it's 11 mils. It's gonna have your ingredients on the back. Okay, so the piece de resistance, you guys, is Madame Glam. And this is what Madame Glam is sponsoring. These are the four polishes that they sent to me specifically for this giveaway. I got to choose the polishes that I wanted. And again, they sent this to me eons ago, but it took me way longer. My titty ball itches. Sorry, I'm over here just digging in my titty. Uh, it took me way longer to reach 3,000 subscribers than it really should have. <laughs> that I was anticipating it taking. And these have been sold out for months. Let's just get this out the way. This is a non no wipe soak off top coat. So this will have an, um, I almost said an exhibition. This will have an inhibition layer. Y'all, I'm so freaking sleepy. Uh, you'll, you'll have to wipe. Anyway, there you go. You're gonna get a gel top coat. Do y'all remember December's collection? December, 2022. I. Even, I, I even had to pause to think about what the hell year it was. They had, uh, geez, was it a 10 piece collection? Like five creams and five zhuzhis, I can't remember. It sold out almost immediately. It still has not restocked, you guys. Three, these three polishes are from that collection. These I'm gonna open and show you, uh, chalet time. And uh, you can even ask G Money, I have waited and waited and waited patiently every flipping month for Madame Glam to restock this this entire collection. Every month, every couple weeks, I'm out there checking the website, seeing when the hell these are coming. And I don't have my flash on, so this is a reflective. It is a like a rose gold reflective. Uh, this was the, my pick. This was my pick, I think, for, uh, for the collection. And I was actually at her house at Thanksgiving, G Money's house at Thanksgiving last year when she received this December collection and I actually swatched it before she did, I will go ahead and put my swatch video up here for you guys to check out. And then later on uh, in my visit, I used this collection and did some nail art on her. I'll pop that one up there as well. So again, this is chalet time. And I can't tell you how hard it is for me to not want to keep these for myself because I have waited for 
effing ever. They're still not back. But you know what? I love y'all so much. I'm going to give up the polishes that Madam Glam sent to me to give away to y'all anyway. This is Love at Frost Sight. And this is the Royal Purple. Oh, God. Glitter. It is so beautiful. Holy smoly. Oh, my God. So, again, that was Love at Frost Sight. And then literally the blue of my dreams. This is Ready, Set, Ski. Oh, God. It's killing me. It's killing me to be such a nice person and part with this. I just want to bite it. Oh, my God. It's basically like a neon blue. It is so brightly cobalted. That's, I know that's not a thing. It is just... Oh my God, it's just deliciousness in a bottle. Ready, set, ski, chalet time, and love at frost sight. Oh, and of course, the top coat. So thank you, huge thank you to Madam Glam for sending me these beauties. But please, Madam Glam, bring them back. Please, <laughs> I beg of you. That's gonna do it. Everything that you have seen so far is what is gonna be in your package. I may even find a couple of extra something somethings to toss in here. So if you open your box and you find some things that you didn't see in this video, it was just me doing some more reorganizing and some more decluttering. <sighs> I feel like I've been talking for days. So you're going to be getting a ton of polishes, stamping stuff, model ones. Again, I have, I have discount codes y'all. Hello, totally forgot. You can save 30% at Madam Glam. Dot com. If you follow the link in the description box below, my code is BLL30. And then I have a 20% off Model 1s. Uh, follow the link in the description box below. The code is MONAIL20. Don't be using BLL20 at Model 1s, honey, because they changed my code. And that does not work anymore. So MONAIL20. I'll have all that info up on the screen for y'alls. So two nine color color cubes, a plethora of other indie brands and stampin' brands and gel brands and this fancy thing and these fancy things and lots of things and uh, beer koozies. You must drop the secret Easter egg keyword or key phrase down in the description box. When G Money's here and when she picks a random winner and when I get my video uploaded, I will have all of the instructions for, um, you know, what, what you have to do to claim your prize. Okay, that does it for me. I got to get my ass to bed, honey. So thank you guys again so much for watching. Thank you for getting me to 3K and thanks for sticking around. If you stuck around this long, cookies, kudos, and trophies to y'all and I will be back very soon. And in a few weeks, I will be back with the winner. So that's going to do it for me. And I will see you guys very, very soon with new nail art designs and new swatch videos and all that kind of a jazz. And I will see y'all in my next one. Bye.